Father's Day is this Sunday, and while fathers teach many lessons to their children, for one family in New York City, a father's lesson inspired an entire career. Mark Forgione watched his father Larry run a restaurant all his life, and in his teens, Mark joined Larry in the kitchen, and eventually Mark opened a restaurant of his own. Now Mark has passed on his culinary skills to his own son, Sonny, and they're keeping the family legacy alive one dish at a time. Mark, Larry, and Sonny join me now. Good morning. Good morning. What do you say? Hello. Hi, Sonny. <laughs> this is such a heartwarming story. Larry, tell us about your restaurant and how your son got involved. Well, an American place was uh, probably the, one of the first restaurants, if not the first restaurant, to exclusively use American ingredients that we sourced from um, the different markets, farmers, ranchers, and so on. And uh, now I'm semi-retired. <laughs> you can be you can be grandpa, right? Now, Mark, not all children follow in their parents' footsteps. What you did, you did, and what what about cooking drew you in? Uh, you know, I've always enjoyed cooking. Um, you know, when I was a you know rebellious teenager, um, if you had asked me if I was going to be a chef, I would have laughed. Um, you know, it was not on the top of my list, but I didn't realize um, kind of through osmosis, I was like learning my, my trade. And as I was like trying to almost run away from it, um, I had this like aha moment, you know, while I was having so much fun cooking, you know, it was kind of like, you know, let's just go do this. You know, I mean, I enjoy it. And from what people tell me, I'm pretty good at it too. <laughs> and Larry, were you surprised when Mark told you he wanted to open his own restaurant? Oh, for sure. Well, I was more surprised that he wanted to be a chef <laughs> because of all of the um, time away from home that you have to spend. But um, I think it was a natural progression for Mark after he did his cooking stints in different restaurants for him to open his own restaurant. And Mark, tell us more about your restaurant. I hear that Sonny likes to spend time with you there. Yeah, so we have um, restaurant um, Forgione, we have uh, Peasant, and we have uh, our newest ones called One Fifth. Um, Sonny likes to come and, and eat, right? You like to come to Daddy's restaurants? Yeah. Yeah? What's your favorite thing to eat when you come there? Appa. Appa. He calls pasta Appa, but he loves Appa. And so what, what can Sonny answer a question for us? What is his uh, favorite part about cooking with Dad? What's your favorite thing to cook? Uh, cookies. Cookies. <laughs> what kind of cookies? Uh, chocolate. Chocolate. Chocolate cookies. He loves making chocolate cookies with, with me and his mommy. Ah, uh, that's and nice. And, and Sunny, do you hope to open your restaurant someday? Your own restaurant? Yeah. <laughs> so Sunny has his own little kitchen already. You can kind of see behind us, he's got his little kitchen over here. And he wakes up every morning. He likes to make, uh, he does eggs with us. He makes his little uh, cappuccinos for his mother, right? What did we make today? Pancakes? Yeah. What did we put on the pancakes? Um, honey. Honey. Honey? <laughs> Well, congratulations, because it sounds like Sonny's going to be opening a restaurant when he grows up as well. Thank you so much for sharing your amazing story, and have a very happy Father's Day. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.